34-year-old John Ballio, seen here in circuit court in November, appeared again Thursday in federal court. He's already serving time for molesting a 12-year-old boy in Battle Creek back in April. Investigators call it a disturbing case. This one, I'd say probably is up there in the top three that we've seen here. Homeland Security agents discovered Balio while they were investigating Ronald Mosier. He's the person who arranged Balio's meeting with the victim. Investigators called Balio a wolf in sheep's clothing. This guy was leading a double life. You know, he, 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 everybody thought he was a model, role model citizen. Balio was a host at a Christian radio station. He was recently married and his wife was pregnant at the time of his arrest. Investigators found a storage unit with pornography and a bondage kit Balio used on the boy. Probably the most disturbing was the, the, uh, the storage unit that with, with contained all the clippings of missing children and uh, how to get away with child pornography and um, it contained that mobile rape kit. Balio pleaded guilty to sexual exploitation and possession of child pornography. U.S. Attorney Pat Miles says it's good that Balio was taken off the street. We really are, are pleased with this investigation and this conviction uh, because it does stop the behavior and it also sends the message to others who would engage in similar behavior that uh, you will be found, you will be prosecuted, and you will serve a lengthy prison sentence. Balio was sentenced to 40 years in federal prison and if he ever gets out, he'll be monitored for the rest of his life.